Good morning, crew. It is right now 5.51 in the morning. We are right now going to head to Buckeye. I'm going to be taking you guys with me. Our first tip is to plan out accordingly. Find out how far you are from Buckeye and what time you should leave. Some people tend to leave the night before to have a chance of getting really rare pops and expensive ones, but the thing is about Buckeye, there's no guarantee of getting rare pops because nobody knows what's in there unless you have a middleman. But anyway, guys, we're gonna leave right now. We're gonna document everything and we'll see you there. So guys, we made it. We are in Buckeye, Arizona. Right behind me is gonna be the Funko place. We were able to secure a really good number. Right here, I got number 13. It's gonna focus. Number 13, I got some waters, crackers, a banana. They are gonna be opening their doors at around eight. Right now it is 725. So from then on, we're gonna show you what, it, what to expect when you're in line and how it is in there. There are places to get food nearby, such as Burger King, QT, and Subway. You could also bring a chair if you don't like standing up and waiting in a line. Now, if you are a veteran collector, you could bring Funko protectors for the pops that you buy. And of course, bring money. The parking is free. For me, I was able to park in front after checking in on the right side. Back when they were first starting the Buckeye event, you would just hop in line and wait. There was no time to be there. There was no restrictions. But now they are starting to do wristbands. Now these wristbands are a good idea and we hope they stick with them. Not only do they go on your wrist, but depending who put them on might rip your arm hair off. But it holds your place in line. So that means you can leave, wait in your car, go eat, do whatever you want. And they will let you know what time to come back so you can get to your spot. Hey Josh, what time did you get here? Six last night. Six I got here at six, like in the morning, yeah. I'm surprised I got such a low number. I thought, I thought it was going to be crazy. Because they said the same stuff they had yesterday is the same stuff they had today. Oh, okay. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Um, I just want to say, I'm Jen. I'm the director of retail. I'm so glad you guys came on this cold morning here. I'm going to give you a morning, honey. Um, just reminding you to act like adults in a collectible store, not kids in a toy store. So no uh, kicking, shoving, biting, all that kind of good stuff, which you don't do here. Um, so we do have a few exclusives. I'm not going to mislead you. There are just a few here. Um, and there'll be one per person. So we're going to file you guys in nicely. Um, and have a great time. I am so glad to be coming to Arizona again, and I hope we're going to have it some more times here. So have a great day. Thank you. Thanks. When you get in, they give you a really big bag for your shopping. There are a bunch of tables filled with Pops, Loungefly, Funko Gold, Biddy Pops, and much more. They do have them in categories like Anime, Marvel, and Disney. And if you tend to fill up your bag, you can always ask for another one. The Funko team is really helpful. 12 seconds later. So we're all done with shopping. They put all your Pops in another bag that you can keep. And let me show you all the stuff that we got. Wait, 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 wait. We need to get luck. There, there it is. is. There it is. Is it? It's, 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 it's gotta be. That's right. Here we go. Commoner Chase. Oh. <laughs> there you go. It's it Chewbacca. Is. It, is. It, is. It, is. it is, right? Oh. That's the. That's, that's, that's a hundred pieces. That's a good, no, that's the hundred piece one. That's the thousand dollar or something like that. It's, it's around a thousand bucks. A thousand bucks? Holy crap. <laughs> now the question is do you get the same one or the one? I don't know. Ooh. That is the big question, isn't it? I don't know. The con ones, I know that were pretty good. That's why I didn't hesitate on them. If there were those green ones, I would have been hesitant. Well, before I put in my let's go. Same box. The same, same box. box. Same box. Okay. That's a good one. And okay. Yeah. That Vader soda, bro. <laughs> Thank you guys for sticking to the end. If you also have tips and tricks for Funko Buckeye, put it down in the comments. If you have any questions, put it down there too. We have a huge Funko community that can help you out. Take care, crew, and peace out.